Hey guys, and welcome back to another future hosting tutorial. And today I'll be showing you how to get a subdomain linked to Cloudflare. Let's get right to it. First of all, let's get our uh, subdomain from Freenom. I found this one. So now once you've done that, you just want to continue and make sure you have bought it. And now you'll see that our domain is here. And now we're going to have to go to um, Cloudflare. And basically, we need to import the thing into here. So I am going to just copy and paste it for the sake of ease. Like so. Now this can take up to some time, depending on how recently you uploaded the um, actual thing. And you'll want to, you could select any of these if you wanted to, but I recommend just going for the free one. And then hit continue at the bottom. Now I'll ask about DNS records, which you don't have to worry about too much. I'll talk about that more in a second. So what you want to do is you want to hit add record once it's loaded and this one you might just want to do join and for the IP address what you want to do is you want to head over to the server and click onto the thing and then head back over to Cloudflare. Copy that and remove the port. You don't want the port in there. Turn that off. Keep that on auto if you want and then hit save now you've done that we're going to add another one now for this we're going to want to get SRV and for this we'll just do that for th this will just mean it's the root one and for the service you want to do underscore minecraft TCP and then you can set a priority and weight to zero now it's time for the port the port is that one there. If you have the standardized port, you won't have to worry about this as um, yeah, it automatically do it for you. Now you've done that, you want to go to your target. Now this is going to be the join dot the and that or whatever your thing is. And now you've done that, just hit save. And finally hit continue. Once you've done this, it'll tell you about your name servers. The name servers don't have to worry about it too much. So all you need to do is hit copy. Go back to your thing, management tools, name servers, and then use custom name servers. And here you will input your name servers like so and then click change name servers once you've done this you can then go back to here and then click done and finish later and now the server should have finished um, setting up the new domain and you just copy the domain go into minecraft or well yeah minecraft and then you want to paste in your server and now you should be able to join it with the new subdomain which i have not actually seen this yet my friend has um has been working on this server i it's not mine, but uh, I decided to help him out with getting one of these. Uh, one thing I'm going to do, I'm just going to check. Oh, God, yeah. See, it's changed so much. Um, but anyway, guys, thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, guys.